Ray's effort actually led me into winning the trophy from the 2011 Australian Open. Yeah! I don't think it will work. Yeah, oh, oh, my inspiration, my number one inspiration. Yeah. Uh, Nadal. Yeah, yeah Nadal. Um, and mainly me keeping my calm during my game. I think that's the most important thing, me keeping my calm during the game. Um, and yeah, my, my name would not be on this medal. If it, if it wasn't if it wasn't for my inspiration, my fans, my family, and of course myself, because I I am a champion, which obviously the medal displays. <laughs> yeah. So um yeah today today was a very good effort, and I think I think I did everything I did to deserve this medal. I'm sorry, but did didn't you lose them today's match? Um, the, have you been to um the new fish and chip shop down the street? Good soy sauce. Ah! Tail! What? Come here, come here, come here. Watch this. Come on, come on. My head. One thing I want to say to the Australian Tennis Corporation is I want the moaning band. I want the groaning band. Now, I'm only going to say that once and I want you to listen. Because it, re it really does put players such as myself off oh, my game. Head up, bird. Head up, bird. Head up, bird. Head up, bird. My head's up. What? Don't. What? Is that pull up? Yeah, Put my head up. Oh, well, sorry. Come here. My, my head up. People want to have my head up. Fuck. Well, the ball boys, they do play a huge part in today's tennis tournament society and um, I'd like to thank MLC for sponsoring them and giving them all those nice gifts for all their hard efforts. Well, on my behalf, I'd, I'd like to thank them. Um, they've done really well this year and and the fans love them. Everyone loves them because like, they, they, they do try their best. They do work their hardest. And the most important thing is... is if what I always do, if, if they do annoy you, which they, they most likely will, because when you're frustrated, just the simplest things tick you off with um, humans and human interaction. So what I always do, I always try to um, ignore them, but at the end of the game, I always, uh, I always go and pat, pat them on the back. Yeah. Um, and, and of course they come up to me at the end of the game, it's like a mutual relationship and they, and they tell me how great I was because, well, obviously I was. Yeah. Well, he's not exactly the best role model to have around and he's very scary. At the, at the end of the game today, he asked me if I can go to the toilet with him. I didn't, I didn't have to go to the toilet, but he hit me. Oh yes, that little incident. Uh, well, um, during the game, the ball boy actually got a ball and piffed it at my head, which I, I am going to be taking into the court of law as it was filmed. And I got, uh, I, I was ball. really concussed and I, I don't remember what I was doing. But um, people from the fans are saying, I heard fans whispering that I did something awful, which I, I hope I didn't. I hope I didn't um, hurt the ball boys at all, because after all, it is their job. And I'm really sorry to my opponent who, who did stop in the middle of his game to say, you know, like, what are you doing? Like, um, but yeah, these, these ball boys, not good. So can you please explain in detail why he did this and what happened and what you did to evoke him? Well, from my understanding, what happened was I just won the point. It's a pretty good point. Turn around. The next thing I see is he's chasing me, he's coming up to me and he pushes me to the floor. Is, is that even allowed? What? Anyway. So what I'm just wondering is, where's my, when, am I, when will I get my medal? Um, I won't keep myself here too long because I've got stuff to go and do so I'll just answer this quickly. The um, hardest thing probably about training is the dieting, um, mainly because you've got to keep up with a nice, fit, healthy diet and I, I just want to say, kids and asparagus is 
an asparagus a day, keeps the doctor away. And uh, eat your veggies, your mum's right. A baby's bottle! Are you serious? At the end of the day, as much as you hate him outside the field, as much as you want to kill him and smack your racket on the floor, what? which you should never do, you should always keep it calm, you always have to show your player the respect, shake, shake his hand at the end of the game and move on with life because at the end, it is all just a game and I'd like to tell my fans and everyone out there that oh, I do it for fun. It's I, I really couldn't care about this medal that I've worked all my life for. Um, and yeah. So, just kids, have fun, respect each other, and at the end of the game, you'll be the winner. Maybe, maybe not with a medal, but you'll end up winning a great, fun, exciting game. Of course, there's always two sides to a medal, and the, the ah. other, my opponent, I'd like to say, played very well and does deserve this medal as much as me. But sorry, but did he win the medal? Um, no, no, no. Actually, I, I won the medal. Um, yeah. Anyway, as I was saying, I'd like to um, thank thank him for a great game and. I, I did get frustrated at times, but I, I had great respect for him. I, I, I did everything myself. I did to get, show him my respect, and um, at the end of the day, we, we both came off the off the field like strong players. It, it wasn't a sore loser. Well, I do love my fans, and I, I don't think I show them enough attention. Even though I, I do give them a bit of attention, but it, it is very casual. Like, I, I don't mind signing the, uh, the usual autograph, but sometimes it does get out of hand, and yeah, maybe, maybe sometimes it, it is one too many, and I can't really handle the stress, especially after I've lost a match. When I've won a match, it's not too bad, even though I just want to go home and fuck those uh, fans that are waiting for me, but it's just... Can I keep it? 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 Can this is obviously the ending of the briefing. I just want to say thank you to my fans again, my, my number one in, inspiration, and thank you to my family. I just really, if I'm allowed to, I'd, I'd like to thank myself. And um, I'll be taking autograph. Um, I won't be taking autographs tonight because I actually have a stretch limo waiting for me. Thank, thank you.